An ECOWAS commission is to begin a regional conference for youths ahead of the region's 50th anniversary. The Commissioner for Human Development and Social Affairs says the purpose of this is to develop a strategy to strengthen the region. Moya Thomas reports. The West African region, with a population of about 400 million, has about 65% youth. The ECOWAS Commission says it has continued to invest in the development of youth as it believes this course will help the region achieve development faster and curb vices, including irregular migration. The commissioner who addressed journalists says ECOWAS is vested in ensuring the team in youth are well educated. We are trying to see how to help young people to invest in uh, natural resources. Are we going to allow people to come and um, exploit our resources? Uh, if Africa is able to start to think about its um, problems of education for gold, uranium, all these uh, wealth that we have, that we should ensure that we have the capacity to exploit them. On humanitarian efforts, the commissioner says ECOWAS has released $9 million for the care of internally displaced persons, refugees, and asylum seekers across the region, except for Niger, Mali, and Burkina Faso. She also disclosed that ECOWAS has reserved $4 million for humanitarian action out of the $25 billion intended for the fight against terrorism. The nine million is for internally displaced persons, refugees, and um, asylum seekers and the host communities. So you see that most people in that group are young people and women. As I had said, it is to enable uh, uh, the resolution of this problem within our uh, region. <laughs> Because some of these people, they move uh, from their displaced either within their countries or across borders to another uh, country. So that nine million is for uh, such cases. ECOWAS also says youth entrepreneurship in the region received $50,000 for scientific innovation startups in order to consolidate youth development beyond education. Muya Thomas, TVC News, Abuja.